In a small town where life flowed smoothly and the sun cast gentle rays over the streets, there lived a woman named Sarah. She was known in the community for her kind heart and unwavering willingness to help those in need. Working at a local store, Sarah often interacted with customers, always lending a sympathetic ear or a helping hand to those who walked through the door. One crisp autumn evening, after finishing her shift, Sarah decided to take a different route home. The golden leaves crunched under her feet as she walked through the park. It was then that she noticed him, a homeless man sitting alone on a weathered park bench. His clothes were threadbare and tattered, and his face was obscured by a scruffy beard and dirt. He looked like a figure from a forgotten story, lost in a world that had long since turned its back on him. Despite his ragged appearance, there was a spark in his eyes, a flicker of hope amidst the despair. Sarah felt an inexplicable pull towards him. Gathering her courage, she approached him, her heart racing. Would you like to wash yourself and eat? I can help, she offered, her voice warm and inviting. The man looked up at her, surprise etching his features. Slowly he nodded, a hint of gratitude washing over his face. Thank you, he whispered, his voice rough from disuse. Sarah took his hand, leading him to her modest home nearby. As they walked, she introduced herself, sharing bits about her life, the joys of her job, her love for the community, and her passion for helping others. The man who introduced himself as David listened intently, his eyes softening as they spoke. Upon arriving at her home, Sarah welcomed David into her sanctuary. She led him to the bathroom, where she provided him with fresh towels and toiletries. Take your time, she encouraged. There's no rush. As he stepped into the shower, Sarah couldn't help but feel a sense of fulfillment. She was doing something meaningful. When David emerged, he looked transformed. The dirt and grime that had masked his face were washed away, revealing a man who had endured much more than anyone should. His eyes sparkled, filled with gratitude, and his demeanor was lighter, more open. Sarah couldn't believe how much he had changed in such a short time. They sat down for a meal that Sarah had prepared, a warm bowl of soup, fresh bread, and a simple salad. As they ate, the conversation flowed effortlessly. David began to share his story, peeling back the layers of his life like the leaves falling from the trees outside. He spoke of the dreams he once had, of a career he loved, and the family he lost. I had everything, he confessed, his voice thick with emotion, a good job, a home, and a loving family. But one tragic event changed everything. I lost my job and my loved ones in a matter of months. It was like a storm swept through my life, leaving nothing but wreckage behind. Sarah listened intently, her heart aching for him. I can't imagine how difficult that must have been for you, she replied softly. It's hard to see the light when you're trapped in darkness. I've faced my own struggles too. Life isn't always easy, but I believe there's always a reason to keep going. As they talked, the bond between them grew stronger. Sarah shared her dreams of one day opening a community center to help those in need. David, inspired by her determination, encouraged her to keep pushing forward, reminding her that every small act of kindness could ripple out and change lives. The next day, as David was about to leave, he reached into his pocket and pulled out an envelope. Handing it to Sarah, he said, this is for you. Sarah opened the envelope, her heart racing as she revealed its contents. Inside was a staggering amount of money, $100,000. She gasped, shock washing over her. Why are you doing this? She stammered, her mind racing. David smiled, a knowing look in his eyes. I tested people for kindness, he explained. I wanted to see how you would treat me despite my appearance. Your kindness and generosity have inspired me in ways I can't explain. This money will help you achieve your dreams or support someone else in need. Tears brimmed in Sarah's eyes as she processed his words. She had never imagined that her simple act of kindness would lead to such an incredible outcome. It was a reminder that compassion could forge unexpected connections and change lives in profound ways. In the days that followed, Sarah found herself reflecting on the gifts she had received. She decided to use a portion of the money to help the homeless in her city. Inspired by David's story and her own desire to make a difference, she organized a charity event, a community gathering where people could donate food, clothes, and funds to support those in need. 
With the help of local businesses and volunteers, Sarah's event blossomed into a beautiful day of giving. The park that had once been the backdrop of her meeting with David transformed into a hub of kindness and generosity. Families gathered, laughter echoed, and the spirit of community filled the air. As the event unfolded, Sarah caught sight of David standing at the edge of the crowd. His presence warmed her heart, a living reminder of the connection they had forged. He approached her, pride glimmering in his eyes. You've done an amazing job, he said, embracing her in a heartfelt hug. You're changing lives, Sarah. This is just the beginning. Their meeting had ignited a flame of inspiration that would continue to spread through the town. Sarah felt a renewed sense of purpose, knowing that her actions could spark hope in others. As the sun began to set, casting a golden hue over the park, Sarah took a moment to reflect. She had not only transformed her life, but had also touched the lives of many others. The warmth of community, the power of kindness, and the strength found in vulnerability had become the foundation of her journey. In the months that followed, Sarah and David maintained their friendship, working together on various initiatives to support the homeless. They became a team, united by a shared vision of compassion and change. Together, they opened a community center, a safe haven for those seeking assistance and support. David often shared his own journey of recovery, inspiring others to rise above their circumstances. His story resonated deeply with those who walked through the center's doors, and Sarah felt grateful to witness the impact they were making together. Years later, as Sarah looked back on that fateful day in the park, she realized that her life had taken a beautiful turn. David had not only changed her perspective on kindness, but had also opened her heart to the possibility of transformation. Their encounter had been a gift, one that had set into motion a ripple effect of love and support throughout the town. And so, dear friends, we are reminded that our actions, no matter how small, can have a profound impact on the lives of others. Just like Sarah and David, we all have the power to make a difference in the world. If you enjoyed this story, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, where you will find many more inspiring tales that remind us of the strength of the human spirit.